JavaScript, the most widely used programming language in the world. But how JavaScript actually works? When you open any page on the internet, your browser receives a file which contains HTML, CSS and JavaScript. Your browser contains engine which transfer the received files into visual representations, basically what you can see on the page. JavaScript is always evolving and in recent years frameworks like React, Vue, Angular, come alive. These frameworks are built on top of JavaScript and help to write code more efficiently. JavaScript is first and foremost a web development technology, but it is so much more than that. You can use JavaScript to develop front-end and back-end web applications. For back-end development, we use Node.js, which is JavaScript no runtime environment, and we can do pretty much everything with it. Talk to servers, write APIs, and talk to databases. But what about the syntax? By learning JavaScript, you will come familiar with terms such as variables, functions, statements, operators, data types. Let's start with front-end development. For front-end browser, create a file app.js and index.html, where you can reference script tag, which browser then executes. JavaScript is oftentimes used to manipulate the DOM. In order to make this button clickable, we use document.querySelector and the element button. And we assign it to variable. In modern JavaScript, we use let or const to declare variables. Let is used for variables that can be changed and const is for variables that they won't be changed. In order to make this button interactive, we need to assign an event listener. JavaScript have many event listeners like mouse over, on click, mouse out, but in this case we will be using on click. We use the variable on click and assign it to a function. In modern JavaScript we use arrow function, but using the all way is still acceptable. Every time now you click on the button, you will receive an alert button was clicked. You can see this in the console log. Hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you next time.